show chapters Pfizer CEO says tying drug prices to foreign countries is not good for patients 10 hours ago, 152. Last quarter, Pfizer chief Ian Reid was upbeat on the Trump administration's plan to lower drug prices. Even after a Trump tweet that led to his company deferring planned price increases. Now, after a set of proposals counter to the industry's interests leading into the midterm elections, Reid's support sounds as if it may be waning. One tenet in particular, a plan announced last week to tie prices of certain drugs paid for by Medicare to an international average, has Reid and other pharma leaders speaking out. I don't believe that the proposed rule in reference pricing to price-controlled markets as a way of setting prices in the U.S. is good for innovation. Patients are our industrial base, Reid told CNBC in a telephone interview Tuesday. Allergen CEO Brent Saunders was similarly against the plan in an interview on CNBC's Squawk on the Street Tuesday, calling it a dangerous proposition and a slippery slope. The administration announced its blueprint to lower drug prices in May, and was generally met with support from the drug industry. In particular, pharmaceutical companies like Pfizer lauded the administration's plan to target drug rebates. Those are the discounts drug makers give to middlemen such as pharmacy benefit managers, often in exchange for more favorable insurance coverage for their medicines. Drug companies argue the rebating system helps drive the price of medicines artificially higher. When Pfizer decided to defer its planned price hikes earlier this year, it said the current prices would remain until the end of the year, or until the blueprint goes into effect. Under Reed's definition, the latter doesn't appear likely before year-end. We don't think the blueprint could be implemented other than seeing a radical change in the pricing model by ensuring that rebates get to the patient. Reed told CNBC, I feel that they've been less rapid than I'd have liked on this discount issue. Reed said he hopes the administration will revise its plan to tie drug prices covered by Medicare. Part B to an international average that's much lower than what the U.S. currently pays. Medicare is the government insurer for the elderly and disabled, and Part B drugs are those administered in the hospital or doctor's office, rather than being dispensed at a pharmacy. Reed did say he is quite positive about increasing competition in the Part B space. Another aspect of the administration's recent proposal Industry experts have noted the timing of the Trump administration's most recent moves seem orchestrated around the midterm elections. Drug pricing is a popular campaign issue on both sides of the aisle. Reid, who hands the Pfizer CEO role to Chief Operating Officer Albert Berla in January, takes a longer-term view. I've been in the industry 41 years, he said, and pricing has always been an issue. Watch. Allergen CEO on Trump's drug pricing policy. Show chapters. Allergen CEO on expanding Botox to millennial and Trump's drug pricing policy. 12 hours ago, 741. VARMPS equals MPS. MPS underscore Q equals MPS underscore Q. MPS dot underscore Q dot Empsony equals MPS dot underscore Q dot Empsony. MPS dot underscore Q dot MPS in it dot push. Function. MPS dot insert component. Hashtag tabula article you may like. Tabula article you may like. Closing curly bracket.